gonna run that disc all day today and I'm gonna run this this spreader trailer back to co-op and then I might get that blade but I'm I got to be working on that that drill over so there. So he's finna take off he's leaving now going back there to the field and then I'm finna go to Alamo and then I got a lot of stuff to do before it rain. And we gotta get some ground disc disc it up as much as we can. That way we got the real disc that's gonna do the rest of the the rest of the hair on everything. Now today's lesson uh, looks like it's finna rain here yeah, in about a couple hours, a couple more hours. So Damien is on his way back to the back to go finish up. Uh, I think he's like it probably about, I don't know, maybe about 150 acres. So he gonna do as much as he can before it rain. I'm getting on the road and I'm finna go to co-op to send this back. And then I'm gonna come back and then I gotta hook this tractor to the to the grill, and I got to be finished working and working on it. And I, I got to put the cutters and stuff on. So we're gonna be planting pretty early in April. So I'm looking sometime next week or the week after when it right. I mean, when it dries up, then I'm gonna uh, finna start planting. So I'm looking at some early early soybeans this year. That's the that's the key key factor of it of this year of today that that I want to do to plant early soybeans. I don't know I'm gonna do any corn. I haven't made my mind up yet about it. Uh, then again, I probably won't plant no corn because I don't have no corn header, and I haven't been really. I haven't been looking for a corn header, and I've been looking online. Well, I take that back. I have been looking online four corn header, but I just ain't made no decision to get one. I mean, I can get one, but I just ain't made no decision to get one because I don't know if I'm gonna plant, uh, plant any corn this year or not. I might next year, I, I don't know. I mean, uh, um, so let me get this, let me get this going um, to Alamo, get this thing back, and then I'm gonna get back at you. Alright, done dropped that off, so now I'm headed back to the shop. And I got a phone call. And it ain't too good, but uh, on my service truck, I told to find out the transmission wasn't going out. It, what it is, the crank had failed. So now I'm gonna need a motor that's six five. So, oh. so now I'm about to find me another truck. I'm about to find me another truck somewhere, wherever I can find it. In. So now I'm gonna go up here and get the tools out of it and think about something else. All right. So now I got the eighty one hooked up to the drill right here. And so uh, I'm gonna start working on it. But before I do that. I'm gonna go up here where the transmission shop is, and then I'm gonna go ahead and get get uh, get the tools out the truck, and then then I'll be back again. I promise you, y'all, I'm gonna get another battery for this thing. I'm so sick of jumping stuff off. I'm gonna take this tractor and move it over the other side, and get it out of the way. I think I'm gonna move the combine right here because I'm gonna get ready to. That's gonna be another video. I'm gonna change the oil in it. Changing every oil there is on it. And uh, as far as the 81 over there, I'm going to work on it, but not today. I promise y'all that I'm going to get a couple vlogs on the 8630 back there in the back behind the water tank. Right there. Where's that water tank at? Right there. So uh, let me get this stuff out of the way, get it lined up, and then I'm going to go back there and then I'm just going to vlog the whole, the whole episode with Damien back there. All right, now I'm in the truck. Now I'm back here with Damien.
Okay, getting windy out here. See, it's getting a little cloudy. All right, so over here, we behind, we probably got 100 acres, 100 more to go. I think we, I slick think we did probably about 80 back here. But anyway. My brother, Damien, he's still distant. And all we like in is that part right there. And it's probably like 15. You go out there, gap right there, may hang a slight, a slight lift down off of that little thicket right there. And it's like 15 acres down off of there. And then we'll go back to the other side. And back that way is 100 acres. So I think we just gonna stop right here. I'm gonna get him a to get that part right there and just get that down there and just stop because I don't think we're going we gonna to make it. So, so as long as I got this much done, I will be perfect. That way they'll give time for it to rain and crumble up, you know, crumble up the dirt. And then uh, I can get that real disc and then just come through. So, so how I'm planning on to do this if when my brother come back in town, so uh, my brother lives in Texas, and uh, what he does, he's a pilot for uh, I think Southwest or maybe Delta Airlines, one of them airlines, American Airlines, one of them airlines. But anyway, he's a pilot for them, and so what he does, he come down here on the week, not the weekend, but the weekday, and he'll spend like two or three days down here. And I get him, and me and him will go to work instead of me just doing all that by myself. Yeah. Which is I don't mind, cause you know that's what I do. Life of a farmer, proud farmer. So this is what we do. So I got him on the tractor. So that relieved me. That way, that give me time to uh, go mess with the drill. Even though I'm supposed to be over there right now, but I'll just wait until after it rains, and then I'll put it together. That be on another video. Uh, the combine, uh, the oil changing that be on the video. Uh, I do need, I do need to do, I do need to do a little bit more bush hogging. That will also be on the video. As uh, uh, far as the truck wise, my service truck being down, I don't know what to do or whatever. So right now, while he, while Damien is distant, I'm going be online surfing making some calls how much they want for this how much they want for that so just to get a price fix on a 6.5 i don't know i might get it fixed i, I just don't know because right now my mind is totally out here so my mind is out here right now so i the last thing i want to hear about is is, is another vehicle I, I can just use this one as a service truck now this right here belongs to my dad my dad passed, he left me with this. And this truck right here, I've been wanting this truck. My dad passed me with this truck. I've been trying to run brand new. And when daddy left out of here, when dad left out of here in 2020, uh, I, took, I took over it, and then I, now I'm starting to take care of it. So, last thing I want to see is a bunch of tunes in here. So, I may keep a few or whatever, but. But right now, uh, I went over there and cleaned the service truck out. I got some of them. I got my John Deere compressor back there. I got my tools back there. So, the tools. Let's, uh, well, I'm well, I'm well. So, I'm just going to keep vlogging Damien and uh, put this on the channel. And then I'm going to get him as well. What do you know? It done started raining. So Damien got that down there. Maybe he can finish that up. And then I can just worry about them 15 acres right there later. So hopefully he can finish that up. That look. Look like he probably got about two acres left. Right here on that little green spot. Alright. Uh, brother just called me. Damien just called me and just told me the, the tractor running low on fuel. So... I told him just ball it up and just let's go on here to the shop and I fill it up, fill it up after the rain. Uh, 
uh, this is about all I can show you for today. So y'all just be sure, like I said, like, share, subscribe to the YouTube channel, comment, have any questions. I'm on it every day of the week. I'm responding to questions. I'm trying to respond. Because now I'm getting, you know, my channel is kind of growing a little bit. And I'm kind of getting more and more and more comments. So I'm actually responding them back. So, so y'all just hit me up. So thanks for watching. Peace.